I want to share with you now a tool that can be useful for integrating information that was taken on the same slide, but with different objectives in different locations and with different experimental designs. Um, so what I've done to give you an outline before I show you that tool is uh, I've been working on the same slice uh, in which I showed you how to do various tiling uh, designs. And in that slice, I've taken uh, a big 5x view, a 10x snap, uh, a few tilings at 20x, one rectangular, one irregular, and a z-stack at 20x. And, and, I, and I would like to have them in some sort of data container where I can see how the positions of each of those uh, images relates to each other. So I'll show you how to do that. I'm going to go to Zen Connect, uh, which is here on the right side below um, all your images and documents. And I'm going to create a new project. I'm going to create it in my folder, and I'm going to call uh, the project Training. Um, say OK. And then once that project opens, there's nothing in it, but I can add images by clicking here. And I'm just going to add all the images that are related to each other. So they're all in the same sample. And it's, as I said, a 5x tile, a 10x just a single image, a rectangular 2-channel 2 2NEX two tile, a 20x irregular, and a 20x z-stack. So when I open all those things, you see that I now have these. Uh, this is the 5x tile, the 10x snap, the rectangular 2-channel 20x, the 20x irregular, and then the 20x z-stack. So I know where everything is in relation to everything else. And I can control the opacity of various uh, layers. I can turn them on and off. So you can see this is sort of the higher resolution irregular 20x. And then here I have uh, the 20x z-stack, which I can move in z with this. And I can you know, turn channels on and off. So I could go, for example, here and turn off the red channel or turn off the green channel. So uh, it's just a nice way where you can relate uh, all the data you've taken, if it's on a same section that you, you know, did, didn't, and you didn't move the slide, you can see where all the images you took are in relation to each other. 